Hey guys, this is Abhishek from Gadgetshoes.com and today we are going to do the quick hands-on review of Freedom 251 which is coming from this company called Ringbells and this phone looks like a rebranded version of Adcom Icon 4 which we have seen earlier in 2015. In this video, we are going to do the quick unboxing and quick review of this phone. As far as the build quality is concerned, this phone looks very nice for the price. It comes for only 251 rupees. Again, you can buy it from freedom251.com website. You will have to pre-book before you can actually get it. Again, the price of this device is something which is very attractive and it comes with a great value in terms of what all you're getting for that particular price. In this video, we will start with the unboxing. As we open the box, the box content which we see, the first thing which we see inside the package is the charger and it should be a one ampere charger however there was no current rating on this package because this was not the Indian retail package but the package content will remain the same and the charger should be 0.5 to 1 ampere as per information which we have got you will also get a tangle free micro usb cable which will come within the package and the last thing which we saw inside the package are these in-ear headphones the quality of these in-ear headphones in terms of the build is good they also look nice in terms of the overall design. They do have a mic module in case you would like to accept calls. You do have mic on these headphones and the audio lead is a standard one. All these things which we found in the package looks like to be a bonus to me because there is no other phone which come with this much of price and gives you all these things within the package. And there is one last thing which comes within the package that is a screen protector. So you are also getting a screen protector for this price which is so affordable for this phone. Unboxing is complete. Let's come back to the device. So this is how the Freedom 251 look like. It has got a power and sleep key on the right hand side of the phone. On the top you have got a micro USB port for data syncing and charging and a 3.5mm audio jack. Again the build quality of the phone looks good for the price. It has got good quality plastic being used. On the left side of the phone you have got volume lockers which are plastic buttons again. You have also got an extra button which will be used for mute functionality later on. At the bottom you have got a loudspeaker. There is only one loudspeaker on the phone and there is also a prime microphone at the bottom as well. On the front bottom you can see that we have a physical home button which looks a lot like iPhone. On the front you have got 0.3 megapixel fixed focus camera, metallic earpiece, some sensors and this is how the camera interface look like. Let's talk about the camera now. In terms of the camera we have got 3.2 megapixel autofocus camera at the back. It can give you good clarity of photos even when you capture in low light. Let me capture a rear camera photo and show that quality to you. Again it gives you a timer before you can capture the photo and in case you want to take a look over this photo clarity I can zoom into it and show you the clarity of the same. If you zoom in you can see that the photo has good amount of details and good after taking couple of photos from the rear camera and the front camera, I was happy with the results on this most affordable phone in the world, which gives you decent camera for the price you are paying on this one. Build quality wise as well, this phone is also one of the best you can get at this price point in entire world across all the brands which you might have seen till now. Let me talk about the hardware specification of the phone. On the SIM card front, it comes with dual SIM connectivity. Both of these SIMs will support 3G and you have got a 1450 mAh battery as you can see and you do have support for micro SD memory card expansion. So you can actually expand the storage and you can insert a micro SD memory card up to 32 GB maximum on this phone. So storage expansion is possible and dual SIM support is also there and both the SIM card will support 3G. Moving on to the hardware, it has got 4 inch of WVG display, it is an IPS display panel. We have got 1.3 GHz quad core CPU, 1 GB of RAM, 8 GB of internal storage out of which 5.45 GB is available to the user and the booking starts from 18th of February and it will start from 6 a.m. in the morning. So in case you would like to buy this one, you will have to book it for the price of 251 rupees only and you can expect it to be delivered before 30th of June as per what they have promised and the booking will be open from 18th to 21st and from 6 a.m. on 18th to 8 a.m. on 21st of February. In case you want to buy this phone, you will have to book it from freedom25.com website and the link to that website is there in the description of this video. Overall, this is a very nice attempt from this company which is relatively new. However, the first device which they announced for a price of 3000 rupees approximately which comes with 4G connectivity is still yet to be available and we are not sure about the availability of this phone and we are not even sure about when you will get this phone. But in case you want to buy this, make sure you book it from their website from 6 a.m. in the morning on 18th of February. That is, this is all we have as far as the quick unboxing and quick hands-on review of Freedom 215 phone, which looks like a very good phone for the price it is going 
going to be available and let's see whether you can buy this phone or not again this is a rebranded phone most probably which is coming from adcom but the overall look and feel of the phone and the price make it very compelling in case you would like to buy it for any of your family member or for yourself this is all we have in case you have any queries and questions please leave your queries and questions in the comment section below you can like this video this video help you by clicking the like button below you can subscribe to our youtube video channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below thanks for watching this video this is abhishek signing off thank you